Hello there everyone, and welcome back to another episode of LEGO Star Wars 3. In the last episode, we finished up Grievous' campaign, and in this episode, we're gonna go and begin Dooku's campaign, which is the last one of the game. Or the first one, depending on how you do things. So, let's go to the Battle of Geonosis. Count Dooku! Chapter 1, Battle of Geonosis! The attempt to thwart the Separatist plot to overthrow the Republic continues. Vast core ships have been discovered deep in the Geonosian Desert. A few bold Jedi and their clone army muster for battle against apparently overwhelming Separatist forces. Joey. Alright then, so, this is technically, well depending on how you do things, the first battlefield level of the game. And this one is base, basically holds your hand a lot because all you need to do is just go around and destroy these structures, which it is pretty easy because they have power generators. Unlike the actual other battlefield areas. Also, oddly enough, Mace Windu isn't like the best Jedi to play as during this, only because his other fellow Jedi, like, yeah, like Kiati Mundi, have faster attack cycles. So sadly, I'm not going to be able to play as Mace that much in this. I'm, eh, I kind of do want to play as him though, because he is one of my favorite Jedi. But anyway, let's just finish up destroying this. And sadly, you don't get any studs from destroying that, which stinks. But oh, well, what you going to do? But you do get studs from the structures. So that's awesome. Also, beware of the droid battalions, because they will be really annoying. But, luckily, there are clone, um, stinking vehicles going around. And I really want to get into the, I think that's called the RX, I think. I can't remember. But basically, that giant laser tank is going to be incredibly helpful when dealing with a lot of these golden structures, because it's the only way I can destroy them. So come over here, you... I'm going to just get in this vehicle. Do, 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 do. Let me get in! Thank you. Oh, crud, it's down only its last health bar. Eh, that's a bit annoying, but hey. I want to get rid of these golden structures, and hey, this will help me out a lot. And it'll actually just speed up the process of destroying the generators, so that'll be really helpful as well. But sadly, it's going to get blown up due to these stupid rocket droids. Dang it, of course it spawns me over there instead of where my studs are at. Alright, bring it on, you dumb droids. Luckily, whenever you destroy a dro um, droid battalion, they will drop studs, so that's nice. But anyway, what I'm going to do is just go slash this power generator. You just have to, you could just go for the power generators if you want. And I believe that's what I'm going to do, even though I do want to get the super kit. But, oh uh, well, and this is almost done. Come on, and booyah. So now these are going to blow up, so I can collect the studs from them. Oh, wait, another RX. Nice gonna go circle around hopefully get all the studs from the other structure heck yeah and go over here also there's the ATTE that is indestructible though it is a little bit on the clunky side to use you'll all see what I mean uh, if I do play as it actually I'll, I'll go to that right now just because why not so basically it does have a lot of firepower. It's just a little bit on slow side, and I like... Jeez. Let me get into this vehicle now, please, game. I prefer using this just because it's more accurate with how it works. And it's just more fun, in my opinion. And I think it's slightly faster as well. I'm not 100% sure about that, but I believe it is. Anyway, that RX has been taken away. Dang. But hey, now I have another vehicle. So heck yeah, and there's only two power generators left, but this level barely started. I don't want this episode to end already. I forgot how short this level was. Dang. 
Okay, so in that case, I might as well try and go for the super kit. Not super kit, sorry. I'm so used to how it's called in Steam Lego Star Wars 1. So in this case, I'm going to try and go around and look for all the studs I possibly can. And I'm going to lose this vehicle right now because it's going to get destroyed. Or not. Anyway, I'm going to get into the speeder bike and see what I can do. Jeez! <laughs> At least I got out of that at the last minute. But still, gosh, my luck today is terrible. But hey, there's another speeder that I hopefully won't run into a giant ditch. Hopefully. Also, for some reason, my allergies today are being really weird. I don't know why, because they've been fine lately. But they just have been. Ooh, nice! Stuff for the mini kit. Anyway, I'm just going to avoid those for now. Just because I'm going to try my best to get the sinking, you know. I'm stalling for time, dang it. I don't want it to end already. <laughs> oh, there's a torpedo generator in this base. Yeah, I've never taken the time to actually see what structures are in this base. And ooh. I assume this is going to need this is going to be one thing needed for a droid. Um, I believe it is, anyway. Yeah, that's for R2. I believe they'll just call it a mini kit. So, hey, if you're wondering where to get one of them, right, it's right in that terminal. So, I'm just gonna go circle around. Oh, hello. Oh, that can only be destroyed with a force? Dang. Also, what the? Oh, that's just for, like, a little character to go down. Similar, like, one slide level in LEGO Star Wars 2. Or complete, like, you know. Anyway, is there anything else? Okay, more stuff. My nose is being really annoying right now. Oh, hey, there's a... What? There's a mini kit back there. It, excuse me? Okay. That's a really weird place. There's another terminal over there. Gotcha. Another thing I can break. Very nice. Another thing I can also break. Heck yeah. I believe there might be some more stuff over here as well. But so far, my troops have been doing really well. Also, um, you can pick up torpedoes as well. Um, and, th and basically yeet them at structures. Example! Oh, yeah. And that'll just base. They'll basically just destroy stuff, which is really nice. And since I'm going for the true Jedi, I might as well... Okay, I'm gonna have to destroy this the old-fashioned way. Oh, hey, you get a trophy for that. Nice. Alright, let... No, I didn't mean to kill my own clone! Dang. I feel bad for that guy now. Alright, come on, let... let's break already, thank you. Getting in the speeder bike, so then hopefully I'll be able to collect everything. Yep, that's gone now. Now I'm just going to sit here and destroy everything. I need to roll my nose really quick. Okay, much better. So, yeah, now we're just going to go and destroy this as well. And just dive into the speeder bike, because that has a better um, pickup range. So that's what we're going to do. Come on, break. Thank you. Oh, crud, I'm getting shot at. Uh, let me get all these studs, please. Thank you. Oh, crud, my bike! They destroyed my bike! Alright. Might as well finish this off, then. Booyah. And now I'm just gonna go destroy all of these dro- That wasn't even- That wasn't really near them, and they just went flying! Okay, then. Oh, hey, hey. Hey, nice, another speeder bike. Alrighty, let's just go around here and go to the last area, which, uh, uh, excuse me, which has a shield and these battle droids, actually. <laughs> yep. Okay, let's take care of these guys now. Oh, wait, there's another um, thing for the mini kit. Might as well destroy this. One of this will give me the studs I need. Nope. Okay, then. Oh, crud. Can these droids just stop, please? Like, the battlefield droids are, like, some of the more annoying enemies to deal with. Just because they can take down your health really fast. So 
So I recommend taking down their barracks first when dealing with them. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. Break already, you fiend! Come on. Thank you. And I also recommend taking down their shield generators ASAP as well. Just so then you'll be able to go in with your vehicle. Though another warning, they can also take down vehicles really fast. So be warned of that. <laughs> so I'm just going to go in and destroy this generator. And that will give me enough for the true Jedi. Come on, break already. Okay, where am I? I can't. Okay, one small little issue I have with the battlefield segments is that the map can take up a lot of space. And yes, yeah, yes, there we go. Dang it. I don't want to die, but oh well, that happened anyway. So we're just going to go here now and destroy these remaining battle droids. And then destroy the last generator. And let's do it with Windu. Why not? Even though this will be a little bit slower, that'll be fine. Come on, break already. Break. It's getting there, I think. I can't tell. Oh, oh if you move the camera a little bit, then you can tell. That's actually nice. But yeah, there we go. Level complete. That was short. And that went really well. And yeah, sadly, these battlefield segments can be pretty short. But hey, they're still a lot of fun. And that's no moon. Yee. And yeah, we got the true Jedi. You guys already know that. And we got a good amount of studs. Nice. And we got one mini kit. I wonder what you get for these mini kits. I know you get the characters, but I wonder which ones. But hey, now we're at 21 gold bricks. So that was... That went really well. Let's continue. So everyone, that is going to wrap up this episode of LEGO Star Wars 3. In the next episode, we are going to go to Chapter 2 of Dooku's story, which is... Come on. Oh, Florum. Nice, I really like this level. It's really interesting. So everyone, thank you so much for watching, and have a great day, guys. Bye!